<laughs> that wasn't loud. Yesterday was 4th of July. There's still fog in the air from the fireworks. Hopefully that doesn't ruin God idea, God's idea for this world, this earth that we live in. But anyways, yeah, I see a bunch of fog in front of me. I still have the that street blocked off. Anyways, yeah, there's a fire truck right there. <laughs> And you guys believe I fell asleep and missed the fireworks and my alarm on my phone didn't even go off. Yikes. 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 Yes, I'm still wearing the same shirt as the last couple videos. I don't have that much clothes because Trump didn't even get to spoil me. Rotten. You know, that's what you're supposed to do as a husband to me. And more importantly... I'm taking a shower today, <laughs> so don't worry, we're allowed to take showers like every three days in this house, so I don't know what's with the rules. I come out here and film a video almost at least once a day if I can. Really? Air conditioning? <laughs> Anyways, because I was really interrupted by the air conditioning, <laughs> let's see. We got this. I almost brought out some juice, but I said I'll save that for later in the day when I need some juice. So we'll eat this. I'm starving right now, and that is what I'm eating. It's actually red um, off camera. I don't know why it's not coming off red. Yeah, it's supposed to blend in with my shirt. Any hoozles. There's the food I'm gonna eat. So how we doing the day after 4th of July? Hope y'all didn't get hammered yesterday. I didn't. Because I, one, take meds, and more importantly, two, more importantly, <laughs> I just don't desire to do that. I want to please God with my actions and, um... I don't want to disappoint God with my actions. So we still voting for Donald Trump. Yep. I'm still voting for Donald Trump. I know people want to know that. We need him in the White House, but, you know, I get my blessings from God, too, you know. We've got to vote red this year, hence my shirt, you know, and this comes off magenta or pink on camera but <laughs> that's funny I'm just saying, Trump Jr., the Shade Hearts raised me once I came back up here in 2009. I found the Shade Hearts in 2014, so that was kind of late, but yeah, it was summer of late, late summer, like August. Yeah, I remember having my birthday with my dad on accident on accident coming up here because it's coming up here was an accident great I hope God's going to be mad at me about that not oh 
That sun is beaming on my eyes. Man, you guys, yesterday, last night, it was packed out here. <laughs> Just two small towns in Oregon that I, well, can be Oregon and Moala, Oregon. Mostly can be. We grew up there. And then we moved to Malala in 2009. Um. I, um. Grew up in small towns, essentially. And I just know in a small town. Um. I grew up in small towns, so I just remember in a small town, especially in Canby, Oregon, like we had um, Canby days and now it's all fucked up because we have the alphabet soup community screwing things up. Um, I just remember in those towns, we used to start fireworks at 9, but I guess it's because I live more east in Oregon. East and west Oregon, if that makes any sense. Um, Happy Valley is east. I'm not saying that we should, y'all should mess around and try to come over here. No, don't do that. <laughs> um... But what I am saying is, um, in a small town, we used to start fireworks at 9, and I ended up falling asleep right before that. I just couldn't stay awake. And then I woke up last night after falling asleep to the fireworks sounds. <laughs> and now there's leftover fog. <laughs> I speak it out in the name of Jesus. Seriously? So how we doing the day after 4th of July, America? Y'all don't throw in your hissy fits and pissing me off. And I will say, I was really disappointed. They didn't have no killer burger over there. They had empty spots. I'm like, okay, where's the killer burger? Luckily, I was able to buy um, some food for my friend and I. Um... I think y'all have seen her on camera before. Carmen wife. I don't know why. But. Yeah. Yeah. A friend. Ashley Holdegger. Jesus, 
So how are we doing out there the day after I am? Uh, I'm not doing too well. They didn't have a Republican booth over there like they did last year. I guess because they needed to get petitions signed. Um, they never email me back, I guess. I hope they could read my writing. <laughs> it's so messy. <laughs> I don't blame a lot of people for being like, hey, y'all people on here, YouTube, and really in, in the world, are rude. There's probably astronauts that go out in space and they're rude people. <laughs> Our NASA's tired of giving up by now. Whew. I cannot believe the way I used to represent anxiety love. What is anxiety love? I will make a song about it and y'all can read that. <laughs> I just finished making a song yesterday. I hope it's good enough. I might have to rename it. It's just, you know, kind of represents what I'm going through right now. Lots of people like it. <sighs> now we're going to eat these. And then I also have some chocolate covered peanuts from Dollar Tree in here. So let's open them up. Oh good. The air conditioning is off. Come on, open. Man, they make these things so difficult to open. Yeah, like I said, didn't have no Republican booth, no killer burger at the at the sinking Fair, fairgrounds over here. Um, I think I'll eat these first. Oh, my hair is like heated. Is that a cat? Did y'all hear a cat? Oh, it's chicken. <laughs> it's a chicken. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, there they are, people. I'm gonna have to brush my teeth off for good. Yum. Dollar Tree needs to start selling produce. I don't have to say that because I take right to cares. I'm saying that because they do. I don't know. Maybe they will never. Um,
I tried to put it where y'all can see any birds, but however you want to do it, however you want to do, boo boo. No, oh, there's someone walking around. I am an early. I'm on the lone and would. I am an early bird in the morning. I am. I just saw somebody walking around. Like, you know, totally normal, biblically normal to walk around your neighborhood. Yeah. He's probably going to the dog park with his dog. That's where the doggies go. So cute. Dogs are cute to me, but cats don't misbehave. You just give them a good home and don't ever leave you. Whereas if you give them a bad home, they're going to leave you like a woman. You can probably change this whole outfit. You can do it. Yeah, I don't. I wish somebody would come up to ask me, come up to me and ask me what is God doing in your life? I wish someone would do that. Is there someone on YouTube that's like posted a video like that? I hope y'all like the. post I did about Donald Trump and me needing to be with the Trumps. Uh, I'm sorry if some of y'all are like my mom. I don't believe we need to be together. But whatever happened to you is what happened to you. Because you let it happen. And. I'm just going to leave it at that. Um, apparently my mother watches my channel and then wants to text message me all this crazy stuff. I just don't have the digest to do that. No, I do not. Hmm. Did y'all hear that? Or is my cat bug visiting me? I love me some cheese with good people. I don't care what anybody says. My YouTube channel censor everybody. Meanwhile, people want to go to Rumble and be free there. Must be my kitty visiting me. Okay. <laughs> Six forty three. I woke up at four twenty something this morning. I think it was more like 440, 441. But anyways. I'm brushing my teeth after this. That's the scary thing though, in this house we get yelled at, making noise.
there's a car coming. They're moving around behind me somewhere. Now we eat this. <laughs> I guess I eat name brand food, okay? I'm on a budget and that's the only thing I can afford. Sorry, Trump Jr. Not everybody knows how to make money like you. The bird. There's the bird. If y'all don't know this company and you live in the Portland area, I'm gonna give it a shout out right now because come on, camera focus. Um, if you live in the Portland area, this place, come on. My friend Ashley yesterday, she's like, I've been calling you. I'm like, I'm watching my favorite thing called the parade. <laughs> I'm not going to pick up my phone. Come on. I know I'm shaking because I'm hungry or whatever the reason is. Fearful that my husband's not going to marry me. Physically. There's a spiritual aspect to marriage, Trump's. Oh, yes, there is. known that my whole life especially since my my um cousin brandon was born well i hope that's readable it says organic org, farm fresh home delivery 503-263-6496 so if you live in the portland area or really the west of Oregon you can call them and see if they'll send you some free fruits and vegetables that are organic and you can pay I paid $45 in Oregon Trail money so Oregon Trail card money so don't come after me just because I'm trying to eat with an Oregon Trail card and don't foster home maybe you people should have thought it through and giving me an apartment like my f good friend in this house spent time with me and I bought her lunch. She's going to pay me back and then hopefully she'll buy me a birthday gift. Hopefully no more headbands. I got plenty of that. Um, <laughs> but yeah, that's the company and I just thought I would call it out. Now is it going to focus? No, because I keep moving. What is? I got it. If you're wondering where I got that, I got that last year at the Oktoberfest celebration in Happy Valley, Oregon. And especially on Happy Valley Nature Park. Booyah. Let's see. <laughs> I better be quiet. Sometimes that gets irritating. It's like, it's, the sun's up. You know, the birds are chirping. Like the birds are making noise. How come I can't?
my god. Not on my hands without falling. Excuse me for guys your name, God. <laughs> my mom, oh, you're fat. And she's like, I'm not saying that you're not beautiful. I'm like, it's hard to know things when your house is a mess. Yes, I call her out a lot on YouTube. And I'm tired of her acting like, oh, well, you just called me out on YouTube. I'm like, and? You are Ruby Frankie, and you have terrorized me plenty enough. I don't want to hang out with you hardly at all. If you're going to behave like a child, then maybe that's where you belong. In prison, where children belong. A slap on the wrist? Yeah, right. Donald Trump and I never got a slap on the wrist. I mean, I did get dismissed in 2022. I'm still waking up. Is it just me? Like, I've learned to wake up really slow in the day. Every day I just get, I, I wonder if my, if my phone got taken from me when I had no source of words. Um, if my phone got taken from me and I never had a phone again. What would I do with my life? <laughs> And I think I'd still be searching for the truth. Oh, yeah. Last year, Ashley told me that the rides were free. And I was going, uh, are you sure the rides were, in my head, I was going, Ashley, are you sure the rides were free last year? Or did you sneak on them? Or were they just kind enough to just be like, oh, yeah, you can go. Why to the kindness in this country? You people, you Democrats, especially in my state, Oregon, I would sure like to preach. Oh, be kind, be kind, be kind, but you don't want to represent being kind. I'm not a Democrat. Sorry. Very conservative Republican. I get yelled at for wearing short shorts in the summer. I don't like being hot. Hot from the sun is fun for me, but internally, hot body, no. Me and hot air conditioning get to get along too well to the point where where we um. I'm trying to make sure Ananda's not like, hey, you were waking me up. I'm like, girl, it's not even 7 a.m. yet. You're complaining. Um, so if it looks like I'm like questioning if I should be talking or not, basically, that's why I trail off and just like don't finish my sentences, don't finish my stories. It's because. Yeah. <sighs> mm. 
Man, I bet today they're like trying to clean up the park over there. Yeah. My friend Ashley needs some prayer, y'all. I'm sending out an SOS. And she was talking about, I would be drinking on this day, but I take meds now. I'm like, I wouldn't be drinking if I didn't take meds or did take meds. It just doesn't matter. It matters just being holy, Miss Goldire. And following God to the ends of the earth because he loves us enough. He loves us enough to not cheat on us, so why would we cheat on him? You know what I mean? Man, I got this letter. I haven't been able to talk about it. But I got this weird letter from either the, I think it was the post office or something. Or, and it was like something about some legal stuff. Because I had sent out my ballot, which in November I will make sure for sure that I take my ballot to the city hall near me or the city library probably more like city hall because I already know where the box is um but somebody I'm, I'm assuming my ballot got stolen or something I don't I don't quite know um and then the, that was what the letter was about because I had asked a caregiver here in my house for some help reading the letter because I did not understand it whatsoever and I was like wait a minute you're doing stand up like my mail got stolen <laughs> I'm like we have Donald Trump being like having to get indicted four times on bogus charges for nothing and you're telling me that you're gonna do um an investigation into my mail stolen I mean it is legal in this country and we take legal jargon very seriously in this country but do we really have to bother with that <laughs> I guess somebody was jealous of my ballot and was like I don't know organs messed up Donald Trump did not do enough to it. And he should have come and visited me. And then done a rally. Um. A while after. And then on to those people walking and talking. Mm-hmm. 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 You should have voted in Christian Jerry's and Lars Larson. I tried calling into a show years ago, back in 2022, because I didn't have any time on my hands. Or I did have a lot of time on my hands. And his number didn't even work on my phone for some reason. I was like, okay, seriously? It was not a doggy. It was like a husky. A lot of dogs around here. What about a cat? You just have to walk the cat and walk itself. Dogs are like, okay. Dogs, dogs are people pleasers. They want to please you. Cats are like, I could care less about you. <laughs> I like the most bitterest woman ever. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, me, Ram.
ka. No, one for the birds. Oh, well, I made sure the birds do that, alright? I don't want to get yelled at for making trash on the front porch. I'm not making trash on the front porch. Yeah, it was a mom that left somewhere with a thing. I'm gonna try to eat more and talk less because I don't want to get in trouble in this house. I was trying to get somebody in trouble in these type of homes. These next guys, chocolate covered raisins. I always want to throw this in the trash can right down here, but I never do. <laughs> I want to please, you know, the God, well, not the God, but I want to please God in the caregivers and my adult foster parents in this house, but they don't have a right to kick me out, and they appreciate the money that comes in. You can believe me on that. Excuse me for the burp. I bet I'm not waking anybody up. That's why I talk to all. In case anybody wonders out there why I'm not talking to my mother, um, it's because she's nuts. Mm, they just make excuses in my family as if they're the Messiah. No, you're not the Messiah. Uh, Jesus Christ is the Messiah and get it right. Miss Jackson, if you're nasty. Pretty good. The sugar from the raisins is helping my brain feel not so hungry. Didn't know that I should open this one first. I'm 
I'll tell you one thing. I'm not being kicked out of this house just because my mom wants to work the devil with my callings. Just because I'm Trump Jr.'s glass of life doesn't mean people need to be mean. You know, there's a lot of disrespectful people out there, like Amy Crowley said in her um, disrespectful older elderly people and just people in general, like Joyce Meyer says. Even though she has tattoos on her body, it's, oh, it's in the Bible. That's not the King James Version. The amount of people ignore the King James Version. Yeah, we gotta pray for my friend now. She's a dagger because she does not need to be drinking alcohol. Neither do you, Brittany Spears. <clears throat> Alright, gotta clear my throat. Um. I'm brushing my teeth after this, whether they like it or not. Mm. I'll be honest, I kind of hate that. I have to buy Dollar Tree food. Like, why can't I buy Whole Foods, you know? Why can't I get that treatment? Why can't I be in the Trump family? Why? And really, at this point, why does it have to be so delayed? Why do I? I have to be spiritually cheated on. My husband, it's, it's almost worth not being with him because of the way he treats me. Well, well, you just don't exist. Who do you think you're talking to when you say that? My poor kitty Bucky, before I left, he would be so hungry. I was like, I'm going to find you some food. And eventually, I found some food on my way into church, I think, one day or something. I was going to do, oh, Lord. I think that there's a, a lot of people like me out there that's like, but Trump hasn't taken care of me. I mean, have. I've seen something from 
Benny Johnson, and he was telling, asking these homeless people, did you ever get anything from Biden and his money? And they all said no. I ain't getting anything from Trump. I ain't getting any attention from Trump. Trump has never reached out to me in the 29 years of my life. And then God tells me, lets me be attracted to Trump Jr. in 2017 at the Easter egg roll. And I'm sitting, laying there on my bed going, okay, um, I think I'm going to marry that man. And then a year later, I told my mom, I'll say sometime after because I can't remember when I told her. I just know she ever since then was like, you're never going to marry him. He's not your husband. Like all this weird stuff that doesn't make any sense at all. And she, she was just like, <clears throat> still to this day, she's like against it and doesn't want me to ever get married. And I'm like, don't you want grandchildren from me that I can actually be taken care of? Like, it just doesn't make any sense at all. And my mother could possibly go to prison for having a Durbin Gates home in Malala, Oregon. It's not okay to play around with fire. One of these days you will get burned. 4747. Um, yeah, anyways, I'm gonna get off of here. I think I've eaten enough. Um, still, I'm still kind of hungry. I wonder if I'm just dehydrated, but yeah, we'll see where this journey takes us. I just hope people like. Trump Jr. understand, like, you just can't go around giving everyone your virginity. At some point in time, there's going to be people that are going to fall away from you and not want to vote for you because you're not holy enough. You know, if you could just be holy and take care of me, I'm sure people would vote for that. Like I said, we'll see where the journey takes us. Bye.